What's good everybody, it's your boy Rob back with another video. And I have here a screen protector, the Glass Shield Plus from the good people over at UAG. They were kind enough to send this out to me. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and set this up on the iPhone 15 Pro Max. Now this particular case is uh, two times the strength of tempered glass. Uh, it does have an anti-reflective technology, uh, advanced uh, anti-fingerprint coating, scratch resistant. It has reinforced edges. Uh, it does come, the, the, the actual uh, screen protector has this black protective uh, trim around the, uh, the, the shape of it. And uh, I want you to take note of that when I do the installation, uh, cause they are called reinforced edges. It has ultra clear high definition and it does include an applicator and a cleaning kit on the inside. Nice presentation. Cleaning wipes, dust removal, all important items. And it does have what they call repositioning film. So for example, this repositioning film is, let's say the screen protector is just slightly off in its application. You can use this to lift the screen protector up without putting your fingerprints on it. Cause sometimes uh, the oils on your fingers can get on the behind the screen protector, making for a bad installation. Now I had my iPhone now for quite some time and haven't placed the screen protector on there. Make sure you always clean your display before any type of installation. Once you're happy, I like to place my dust removal back on the pa uh, same paper. There's an actual frame. It is labeled top and bottom, so make sure you pay attention to that. Place that on. Now you do get, how many here? Get one. Again, you notice that black trim around the screen protector itself. That's that um, extra protection. Got some air pockets in there. Trying to work those out. Got to work some of those air pockets out. And usually once you do an installation like this, you need to at least wait a good 24 hours to see how that installation works out for you. And perfect installation. Uh, it does cover the sensor and the camera and the screen protector. So it's not a, a cutout for the dynamic island. Okay, that's gone. Kind of rub that out. But uh, for the most part, I like this. It has a, a nice look to it with that little black trim. It kind of blends in with the bezel, so you won't see it on the actual display itself. That pretty much does it. It do have some instructions on the inside, so if you don't like the way I pretty much did it in this video, by all means, feel free to follow the instructions and uh, do it that way. A lot of us creators, when we put on screen protectors, we put on so many of them, we kind of shortcut the actual process. And uh, if you want a step-by-step -step, uh, process, step-by-step uh, -step instructions, always go by the uh, instruction guide that comes with these screen protectors. But uh, that pretty much does it for this video for the UAG glass shield protector. If you have any questions, leave that down below. If you like this video, thumbs up. And also don't forget to subscribe. And other than that, catch everybody in the next video. I'm out.